Python. Everybody learning Python, running for Python. In today's video, we shall discuss about is Python much hyped? And then you can decide for yourself whether you should learn Python in this coming year or not. We will discuss about what Python has stored in for all of us, what are its application benefits and its scope, and how is Python really powerful and standing out from the competitive languages and it is just beating them. So guys, here we come. Okay, Python, let's understand what is Python actually. So this is a very, um, I would say general programming language. And as you can see here that um, it is a language which is a high level programming language. Now, when I say high level programming, this means that this is more of having a human touch rather than a machine touch. That means it is uh, humans can understand high level language much easier than uh, machines so it has an advantage that you can understand that better so it is that's why it said it is a you know high level machine learning language and uh, when you compare it with c c plus plus java which are other high level machine learning language python has an edge and why what is that edge we will discover it very very shortly now as you can see in this picture he is he is the one who is to be credited for designing python and he is Gideo van Rossum. He's a Dutch programmer and he's the creator of Python. So he discovered, actually he designed it in uh, late eight, 1980s, but it got implemented in 1989. So now it is gaining much popularity, guys. So now we walk on to another, another very crucial point is that what Python has stored in for all of us really what are its applications so to put it precisely so python is good for if you are involved in mobile and web development applications python is a must go and we shall discuss it because this is a really hot and burning thing for python if you're for some scientific computing and research for game development you've got pygame and for system administration you can go in for education by teaching students python because they really want to learn python so you can go in education business industries institutions so there's a huge scope for python over there you've got if you learn python you can get into machine learning data science statistics data analytics and so much is there there's a lot of scope for python i will specifically discuss about the web development with python and what are the platforms you can really support you for that so I, we have some, um, you know, Python frameworks, like here you can see in the logo, um, like Django, Pyramid, Flask, and Tornado. They help you in building web applications um, and really web websites, which can handle a lot of traffic. A lot of um, crashes cannot happen because they make your sites really stable. They make your apps really stable. So robust web applications can be designed with the help of these platforms and supporting language is Python. So Python, when it becomes very simple to code, you can easily design your web application, easily design your app and just launch it and earn money from that. So that is why uh, people are going for, you know, doing the course of Django, Tornado, Flask, and understanding what Pyramid is. So if you want a detailed video on that, just, just let me know. Okay, now we will work on to the interesting part of this video and the main part of it that why Python, what Python has in for you, and should you really be doing it in 2021? So guys, here's the answer. You decided for yourself. Number one, simplicity. Python was designed keeping in mind the simplicity aspect of it because all the programming languages which we have now like C, C++, Java, you know, I have also done my engineering in IT, but I really found it really difficult to reciprocate with these languages to understand the syntax. I was lost. The task was lost. What, what really do I have to do from this problem actually? Because I was lost in debugging the syntax, the comma, the arrow, the colon, everything and the entire purpose of coding was lost and this was not simple this was making life complex for me rather than making life simpler for me because coding is something which has to be simple which has to be just simple seriously i mean i don't have any other word for that simplicity that's why python offers you simplicity guys and i found my language really i'm telling you when i worked with python i was like yes this is designed for me i i 
if you are a technical person doesn't necessarily mean that you are a coding person but with python you can become a coding person even if you are from a technical or a non technical background so i would say that python really teaches you coding python really um do justice from justice from an perspective of uh, that it is it is uh, you know non discriminatory uh, treatment to everybody to all all walks of life to all professions and designations role background whatever you have python would be just i'm telling you okay it is not biased it has no prejudice so uh, i come to the point that simplicity that's why it makes python really simple and powerful language and it stands out from the languages like c c++ java r and uh, one more thing is that um, python is very readable its syntax is very easy just you have to understand a few basic concepts and you are good to go with python i am really loving this language the next thing which makes python very famous is accessibility so what do you mean by accessibility that means if you are stuck in some code you are not moving forward you can find a way you know how to go about it because you've got ample amount of resources on internet guys you found me see okay so everything is accessible if you're stuck anywhere you've got it you can just get an answer of that as compared to other languages and this brings me to another third important point and that is community support community support is really important for any language to become strong and very powerful and for python python is blessed it is very lucky and fortunate enough that it is having a community support of love, of like millions of developers who are making this language really robust and popular you've got videos tutorials documentation you've got blogs articles and what not you can find it anything you just write it on internet you would have it for python you are not stuck and that is how i also learned so this community really helped me to grow so i really thank the community and guys you are if you are listening to this video you have again you are you know again part of the community you are helping growing and evolving so this is what python be because you are helping each other to grow and understand why python why you should learn so community is growing everybody is understanding and they are understanding the potential and and, and its real power so this brings me to another fourth point why python for 2021 and that is it is also platform independent so there are many languages which are platform independent this is not something new with python but yes if you run a code on different os like i have a microsoft if but if you want to run the same code on your os um mac then it will run perfectly fine in linux ubuntu any of the os your code is perfectly platform independent it is it is not dependent on the machines right okay i walk you through one of the most important point why to choose python is its libraries guys python has got libraries for almost everything you're searching for if you want to enter into data science if you want to enter into artificial intelligence a sub field of that or you want to perform machine learning tasks you want to go into data analysis data engineering you want to project your data data visualization image processing nlp natural language processing everything you name it you've got libraries for that and these libraries are evolving over time they are developing and they are becoming much more stronger and and one more thing to add here is that they have stood the test of time few libraries are so mature that i can say they are old enough they are decades old and so much of research and so much of uh, so much of uh, i would say uh, features are being added functionalities is, are being added in this library that they are really very powerful and can support a huge number of projects and applications and we are really making use of it deep learning you name it nlp computer vision python man python okay so now i come to the last part of it decide it for yourself guys if you want to be simple you want to make your code really 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 readable so that you can understand it you can make something good out of it and you can present it and you can really delve deep into data if you really want to be if you want to develop games if you want to go for web development website apps you name it you have it in python you can do it with python python has become so robust and and the most important thing you need in life is simplicity guys we don't want things to be complex and python is coming uh, to rescue people like me who can really work 
work with code who can go along i could not even dare to you know uh, step into c++ or stuff because it was complicated for me i was not understanding why why the language has to be so difficult and it it is going to solve complex problems but the language itself is complex it is not simple for everybody to learn so uh, i think yes python is for people who really want to learn in a simple manner and can do great tasks so if you are not involved in in, in all those complex stuff and if you are easy going and you can understand a simple language then think for yourself whether python is for you or not for this coming year 2021 22 and python is here to stay for a decade more than a decade because it is really gaining a lot of popularity because of its high robust features guys i cannot underestimate the power of community and the library support that python has and once you start working with it you will also realize that this is really powerful now i end this video saying that guys happy new year merry christmas and keep liking keep subscribing